Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Kujay once again. So the Miami Heat is going soft now. I mean, I know they're in first place in the Southeast Division, but damn, come on. How you how you gonna be the first place in the Southeast Division, second in the Eastern Conference, and not be the New York Knicks or the Orlando Magic? Especially when you had a 20-point lead, and then all of a sudden you, you let them beat you like that. I mean, damn. <laughs> Yeah, and now you're and now you're going against the San Antonio Spurs. I mean, I'm watching the San Antonio Spurs game with the Miami Heat. They're not really playing as a team, and the reason why the Mi the Miami Heat keep on losing to good teams or teams they should already beat is because they because the team and the coach always rely on LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, and Chris Bosh. They always rely on those three. So it's like. If they're down by three and they need to make a three-pointer, then guess what? Someone got someone got to make a three. You know, one of them has to make a three. It's got to be Bosch. <laughs> it's not Bosch. What the heck? Yeah, Bosch. Yeah, Bosch. <laughs> is it uh, is it Wade, or is it James? I mean, it's got to be it's got to be one of those three. And you know how LeBron James is when LeBron James, you know, when he has to make a game-winning shot or or a tiebreaker, he's gonna he's feel rushed. He feels rushed when you, I mean when you see this guy trying to make a Tight break or game winning shot. That guy always feel rushed. Maybe if you get the ball to James Jones or Mike Miller, maybe they can make the shot. I mean, that's what they can do is start relying on the big three. Because they really need to stop relying on the Miami's big three. That's not how they're going to get anywhere. Because they got a tough schedule. They, The Miami Heat, on Sunday, they got to go against the Bulls. And then after that, they got to go against the Trailblazers. They got to go against the Lakers. The Grizzles, the the Bulls again, and this was gonna be, this is gonna be at home. They gotta go against Thunder, then Hawks, Nuggets, and then they go against the Pistons, which I I really don't give a damn about the Pistons. I know it's they're called the Detroit Pistons, but I really don't give a damn about the Pistons. They're not from Detroit, so why should I really give a damn? Okay, and then they gotta go to the Seven Sixers and the Rockets and the Cavaliers and the Wizards. So they really got a tough schedule in the middle of March. Well, starting from right now in the middle of March. They really have a tough schedule. So they really have to win these games. If they don't, then don't expect them to go to the NBA Finals. No, really. Because cause really, here's what's going to happen in the NBA Finals. It's going to be the Boston Celtics versus the San Antonio Spurs. Oh, yeah. Those are the two best teams in the NBA. Unless, unless the Spurs or the Celtics F up in the playoffs, it's going to be the Celtics versus the Spurs. Don't expect to see the Lakers or the Heat or the Bulls make it because it's going to be the Celtics versus Spurs. That's all I can say. So, what do you guys, so for people who watch this video, what do you guys think about the Miami Heat right now? Do you guys think they are soft now since they can't beat teams like the Knicks or the Magic and they damn sure can't beat the, the, the Spurs, man? NBA's best. <laughs> Yeah, but still, so what do you guys think about Miami Heat? Do you guys think they're soft or they just need more time to, to work as a team? Alright, that's all I got to say. Contact me on Facebook, MySpace, and Twitter. Contact, contact me on Skype, Ella Cool, JJ Jabari. And make sure you check out the Sports Today Show, Saturday, 6 p.m. Eastern. Y'all yeah, know what this is. Alright, that's it. LeBron, what happened, man? You should say your ass in Cleveland. Dwayne Wade, you're alright. You're alright, man. You're alright. Maybe you should not. Maybe you should, you know, do do you, and not trying to have a, a psychic with you like LeBron James and Chris Bosh. Go back to Canada, man. Go back to Canada. That's all I gotta say. Peace.